In this particular problem, we are provided with the function sine a t. So we need to determine the Laplace transform of the given function. To do that, we will begin by writing the given function sine of a t in the Euler's form and that will be e raised to the power of i times a t minus e raised to the power of negative i a t whole divided by 2 i. Now we will take the Laplace transform on both sides such that we get Laplace transform of sine of a t will be equals to Laplace transform of the Euler identity of the sine function which is e raised to the power of i a t minus e raised to the power of negative i a t whole divided by 2 i. So we will use the property of linearity and rewrite it as 1 over 2i times Laplace transform of e raised to the power of i a t minus 1 over 2i times Laplace transform of e raised to the power of negative i a t. Now we know that Laplace transform of the exponential function e raised to the power of a t is 1 over s minus a which is defined for s not equals to a so we can use this fact and we get 1 over 2y times Laplace transform of e raised to the power of i a t will become 1 over s minus i times a here we have replaced a with i a minus 1 over 2i times 1 over s minus here we'll have negative i a so instead of a we are replacing it with negative i a now factoring out 1 over 2i and combining the first term and the second term gives the product s minus i a times s plus i a into the denominator and in the numerator we will have s plus i a minus of s minus i a so that gives us 1 over 2i whole multiplied to in the numerator we have s plus i a minus s plus i a divided by s squared minus i a squared here what we have done is we have used the identity the product of a minus b and a plus b gives us a squared minus b squared now we know that a i squared is negative 1 so s squared minus i squared a squared will become s squared plus a squared the s and s in the numerator gets cancelled leaving us with 2 i a in the numerator so we get 1 over 2 i times 2 i a divided by s squared plus a squared and this finally gives us a divided by s squared plus a squared so the Laplace transform of the sine function, Laplace transform of sine a t will be equals to a divided by s squared plus a squared.